you that don't know what this is, this is the baton I received my freshman year of track and field. It says most improved distance. Now, I never really ran long distance before my freshman year and didn't really like it. To this day, I still don't like it. But without running, I would not be where I am today. So with that being said, I think it's best if we start from the beginning. I joined cross country my freshman year of high school because I needed to lose weight for wrestling. That was the main purpose of joining. But I ended up making a lot of new friends and memories. And I'd like to thank Ben, George, Owen, Tyler, and the Jodemans for pushing me along the way and making those memories with them. I also made a goal that I wanted to be in varsity the very first meet and throughout the season. I ended up being in varsity the very first week throughout the season. And um, during sections, um, I ended up running in 18-10 as a freshman, and I was the number three runner on varsity. So I'd like to thank both my coaches, Coach Borma and Coach Dengary, for giving me the opportunity to do that. I remember for a section practice, uh, the boys were supposed to go for a 45-minute run, and it doesn't matter where we were supposed to go for a 45-minute run. The girls went out on their 45-minute run with the two coaches, and we went to George's house instead. We ended up playing Guitar Hero and eating grapes and bananas along with snacks, and then went to his hose and washed ourselves off to make us look sweaty instead of running. Memories like these are what kept me in cross country throughout my high school career, no matter how much I hated it. Moving into wrestling, I felt above everyone else because of the conditioning I had from cross country. So I'd like to thank just the sport of cross country just giving me the opportunity to feel more conditioned and my endurance is up. Now into track, some of my friends that were in cross country were also in track as well, like Ben. Ben encouraged me to run the two mile in track because I could keep a fast pace and it's the one thing I was really decent at. So I asked the coach, who was also Dengaru, if I could run it. She said, yeah, sure. I ended up running it and I ended up making it to sections and I was the only freshman boy to make it to sections except for Gavin Sunby, who's also a long distance runner. I ended up taking seventh as sections, running at 1051, and without Ben encouraging me to run the two mile and Dengarud letting me run it, I wouldn't have got this award. So with that being said, if I had to give any advice to anyone, I would say make small goals that you can reach. Don't make goals that are like, win a state title that could take years. Make goals that you can reach and that'll keep pushing you forward and once you reach it, make a new goal. Thank you.